Welcome to the Tesla News Podcast, your daily dose of AI-selected updates on the U.S. carmaker. Tesla's Elevated Model 3 Inventory and Price Cut Suggestions Tesla's Model 3 inventory levels in the U.S. are high, according to Future Fund's Gary Black, citing data from tesladata.matyoung.net. Despite previous price cuts since January, inventories remain elevated. The fund manager suggests that Tesla reduce the Model 3 performance price to $49,900 or price the Model 3 long-range, all-wheel drive at $44,900. Current Model 3 performance pricing starts at $52,990, only $1,000 below the Model Y performance. Wall Street analysts remain pessimistic about Tesla's margins and are unwilling to buy into Elon Musk's argument that present margin hits will be offset by future full self-driving software margins. Tesla closed Friday's session up 2.57% at $164.31. Tesla vs. Lotus in the race to autonomy. Currently at level 2 autonomy, Tesla faces competition from Lotus Electra, which targets level 4. Lotus believes that integrated litter sensors will enable level 4 autonomy, but Tesla's reliance on cameras alone may limit their progress. The CEO of Lotus Robotics prefers a hands-off approach to measure success, with test versions of Electra driving over 120 miles without intervention. The ultimate goal is 100,000 kilometers per intervention, meaning no human interaction is required. Electra constantly improves its autonomy through OTA updates and offers different autonomous behaviors for different drivers. The Electra is currently available for sale in China and will arrive in the U.S. in 2024. Fears over Tesla's financial position amid price cuts and expansion. Tesla is reducing prices to entice buyers amid rising recessionary fears and high inflation. Their Q1 earnings report revealed a 12% drop in stock, the nearly 10 percentage point decline in gross margin, and 80% less free cash flow Yo Y Truist Financial downgraded Tesla's stock to hold, while Goldman Sachs set the price per share at $185. Tesla is focusing on cost reduction and remains profitable on a per-vehicle basis despite the decline in margin. The cash flow decrease, however, may limit Tesla's ability to invest in new products and services. Tesla Model S and X Unavailable in Asia-Pacific Countries Tesla Model S and Model X are not available for order in certain Asia-Pacific countries, including Australia, Thailand, Singapore, and New Zealand. It is unclear why these models are unavailable, and Tesla has not responded to requests for comment. Model 3 and Model Y remain available in these countries. This follows Tesla's recent move to cut prices on some models to boost demand. Although the company set a record for deliveries in the January to March quarter, Model X and Model S deliveries slumped by 38%, causing concern among investors about eroded margins due to price cuts. Reliability concerns over Tesla's semi-truck. Tesla recently launched its commercial electric truck, the Semi. Yet, concerns are rising about the truck's reliability after a recent breakdown of a Tesla Semi in California, requiring it to be towed by a diesel-powered vehicle. Major corporations like PepsiCo are transitioning to electrified vehicles to reduce their carbon footprint, making the commercial vehicle segment increasingly important for electric vehicle manufacturers like Tesla. The semi-truck features a tri-motor setup, delivering around 900 horsepower and 1,600 pound-feet, 2,170 newton-meters, torque, with a 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration in 20 seconds, and a starting price of $150,000, 1.23 crore rupees. Tesla's price war strategy draws comparisons to Ford's Model T playbook. Elon Musk has been cutting the prices of Tesla electric vehicles multiple times in recent months, sparking a price war and improving sales numbers. Comparisons are being drawn to Henry Ford's successful 1913 strategy of slashing the prices of the iconic Ford Model T. Ford CEO Jim Farley sees similarities between Musk's tactics and Ford's Model T playbook. Tesla has implemented six price cuts in 2022 alone, aiming to increase vehicle production from 2022 numbers and establish a target of producing 2 million vehicles in 2023. The company's increased production and price cuts may harm profit margins, which displeases investors. Nonetheless, Musk believes he is making the right move and intends to harvest margins in the future through autonomous driving software revenue. Tesla's future value and Kathy Wood's price target. Kathy Wood, the CEO of ARK Invest, is confident in Tesla's future, setting a $2,000 price target for 2027. Wood believes that Tesla's full self-driving FSD, beta and robotaxi fleet will be key drivers of value, with ARK Invest predicting that Tesla's robotaxi business could see as much as $8 or $10 trillion in revenue by 2030. 
Tesla remains one of ARK's largest holdings for the ARK Innovation ETF, with a total 9.4% weighting. Both Wood and Musk emphasize the need to scale Tesla's autonomy and maximize units for future profitability. Tesla Model 3 vs. Honda Accord Hybrid Price and Performance Comparison The base Tesla Model 3 2023 starting price is $39,990 before incentives are applied, cheaper than the top trim Honda Accord Hybrid. A federal tax credit of $3,750 and a $2,000 incentive for Colorado buyers bring the total to $34,240 before taxes and fees with incentives applied. This is $3,000 less than the 2023 Honda Accord Hybrid Touring, which is priced at $37,890, while the Tesla Model 3 has a range of 272 miles and can reach 60 miles per hour in 5.8 seconds, the Honda Accord Hybrid achieves up to 46 mpg in the city and 41 mpg on the highway. This comparison highlights the pros and cons of each vehicle, with the choice ultimately depending on factors such as charging capabilities and potential fuel savings. This is all for today. Tune in tomorrow for more updates and don't forget to like and subscribe. Although hopefully of informative value, the purpose of this video is entertainment and not any kind of advice, especially not investment advice. The content is AI-generated and hence potentially contains errors. Links to articles for further reading on the discussed topics are provided in the video description.